All right, everybody. Today we're going to take a look at the... I had to write this down because uh, I couldn't possibly remember this word. The Yi Zan Yizhan I3H. Yeah, that was it. Okay, now that I got that out of the way. It says I drone on there, but anyway, <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> it's a quadcopter, okay? There it is right there. It's one of them tri-blades, one of them tri-blade deals with the brush motors and the, the little halo on there, you know. Looks good. I did all the, took all the packaging off of it. make it a quickie. Here's the battery. It's a 3.7380. There's the charger, spare props, and screwdriver. You know, the usual suspects. Here is the controller, and it says on here correction function. If the Copter cannot upward straight. I guess that means go straight. Please make adjustment pressing the speed conversion button to 100%. Also keeping the throttle stick and direction stick to left bottom. But that's a bug. Yeah, get out of here with that. Here's the transmitter. Um, I guess this is the rate here, and that's for the video or... Uh, the video here they have the rocker switch on here where it has like a double function you know the button and I guess that's for the flips because that's it has a couple of arrows like going in a circle and then down here is the I guess this would be the return to or the headless maybe and that looks like a takeoff land type deal We'll figure it out, right? It can't be that complicated. Here's the ba here's where the battery goes, right in here. Hopefully, hopefully it'll go in there. I didn't get the one with a camera because actually they have a version of this that has a FPV screen, but I didn't. You know, I didn't want to go that route with this thing. You know, it was cheap enough. This thing was as dog cheap. Let's bind it up. Yeah, it was dirt cheap, so I didn't want to, you know, go into getting the FPV model, which they have in here, right here. You'll see it has the FPV screen on it. Looks pretty cool. Now let's see what these buttons are for here. Let's try to calibrate. There it goes. Down and to the left is the uh, level calibration. Oh yeah, looks good. Oh yeah, sounds good. Let's see if this is the flip button. Yes, it is. It flips in all the directions, too. Let's see what this here is. Okay, that's the return to home button. Right there. Something's beeping. <laughs> I don't know what that's for. Okay. You have to turn that. You have to hit the return to home button again to get it to stop doing that even though you can override it with a stick you still have to hit it again to um take it out of the return to home now let's see okay that's the rate look at the pitch on that thing wow that's pretty severe there's the yaw speed And there's the roll. It's pretty good, man. That roll speed. That's that's very nice. This thing flies nice, guys. It handles real nice. It's very nimble. 
Oh, I can't wait to get this outside. I'm really kind of surprised by uh, how well it's uh, handling in here. Now, let's see. Okay, that was some, I was looking at that video button, but I don't have a camera on it, so. Look at that, man. Wow. Wow, that pitch is impressive. Very nice. Very nice. Boy, I'm really surprised how well this thing's flying, man. Holy cow. All right, boys. I ain't going to test the battery. I just wanted to take it up. I think this is the land button right here. Well, I thought it was. It is. You just have to hold it in. Just tap it. It doesn't do anything. Even though it'll beep, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't go into the land sequence. Wow. Real nice, guys. Real nice. I like it. Boy, that thing flies nice. All right, guys. I'm going to get it charged up and get it outside. The Yi Zan Yizhan I3H. Might be a winner. As far as a good flyer, definitely can tell you it's going to fly well. We'll just have to see how long that battery holds up outside. All right, guys. Have a nice day.